Hi guys, it's Marky. How's it going, everybody? What's going on, guys? I got some new Matchbox. Bunch of new Matchbox. I want to show you these. This is the Bronco 2021 Ford Bronco number 34 of 100 for Matchbox of 2022. This one comes in a really nice blue color. Wow, check out the little Bronco right there. Isn't that awesome? The Ford badge on the left. Have a nice uh, tire there. And check out the lights. Sweet, looking so good. Loving the black uh, chrome on the wheels. Four-door vehicle. Plus that gate in the back. Spare tire covered up here in the back, really cool. Well, it's actually uncovered. You can see the wheel on there. And then uh, the handles on the doors are all painted over in blue. We got the side view mirrors. There's the front of the Bronco. Bronco name right there. Beautiful lights and nice grill in black. Very cool. And we do have well, a bunch of little garbage things there. I don't know what it, what that is, what is that on the hood there? I don't know. Some stuff there. We do have a bunch of ridges up here. And it looks like a windshield wipers molded right on the glass. And something happening right there. Maybe part of the windshield wiper molded into the die cast. Left side driver, nice dark color inside. The windows are rolled down in the front for the driver and the passenger. And we do have a support beam in there. You can see that beam right there. Right between the seats there. Very nice. 2021 Ford Bronco. Stamped on the bottom here, Matchbox 2020 copyright. There's a little elephant. And I don't see any details for the exhaust. Let me see back here. Yeah, maybe this right here. Maybe that little piece right there. I think this might be it. We have a little spot for the license plate. This door does open, I think, this way like that. It has a big handle there on the side. Beautiful color for the Bronco. Awesome. And we have another one here. This one is the Ford... 1936 Ford Coupe, 1936, wow, this one goes way back. And this one comes with that little plastic piece inside to hold it in place. You can see that right there. 1936 Ford Coupe. That looks pretty nice. It has that black uh, metallic color in, I think, what did we get? Was this one black? Yeah, kind of similar to this color. One that op I opened up, uh, I think, yesterday or the day before. Yeah, same color. This one is uh, 2012 BMW 3 Series. Touring, the touring wagon, same color as the 36 uh, Ford Coupe. Number 48 of 100 on this one for 2022. I'm liking this mix. It has a lot of nice, nice matchbox cars that look so good. Let's check out the markings on the bottom. 1936 Ford Coupe marked there on the bottom of the uh, running board. Made in Thailand down here. There's a little elephant friend. And we do have a little something going on there down the middle. What is this? Little piece of, uh, I don't know. Something black there. <laughs> Don't know what that is. Maybe from the paint, the rivet or something. Very cool. The lights look pretty good. I like how they li the lights look and the grill looks pretty nice. The tampos might be on a little crooked <laughs> on the lights, but they look pretty neat. Look how they are. Yeah, they're a little bit to the side, which makes him look like he's looking to the right. <laughs> And then the window.
windows are rolled down. Only two door car. And we have this little compartment back here. Lights in the back with no color. Just painted over in the black. Old style hubcaps or old school. Big bench seat in there in silver color. It is a left side driver or left side drive, however you want to say it. We do have some grills here on the side. I really like the front, how the how the uh, the lights and the grill completed. Back here, a little bit plain with no color on the lights and no spot for a license plate back there. No mirrors on the side of this car, but a really nice 1936 Ford. Very, very cool. All right, next up, I got the, uh, the Land Rover. 1965 Land Rover Generation 2. And the vintage line has a Land Rover and that's why they call this one the Generation 2. Kind of like a reissue and modified. The old Land Rover that used to come in blue and I think maybe a green, I don't know. I think it was like, blue is the one I remember the most. The old vintage blue one that came with this kind of same thing on top. Check out the glass on this one. It's kind of like a metallic light blue. Just all painted in. No interior on this one. No side view mirrors. Yeah, they do have, does have side, side view mirrors. Here's the front end. No extra colors for the lights. Just all painted in white with a black bumper and plastic. All white on the back end. Cream plastic uh, accessories on top. And then we have those uh, zebra stripes or tiger stripe on the side. The Land Rover logo right on the door. It is a four-door vehicle. And then we have the Matchbox Africa badge right there. And on this side, same thing, Land Rover and Matchbox Africa. A nice uh, gold stripe or ring on the uh, blacked out hubcaps. Very nice. It does roll super nice and smooth. These plastic wheels are amazing. The way these cars roll. So, so far we have these three. Adding these three today to the collection. As I keep opening more Matchbox. Here we go, another one. 1948 Willys Jeep. I have a few of these Willys. I have a blue one, I have a red one. And I can't remember the other color, but anyways. Now I have a camel version. It's like a cream with a camel print on it all tan in front tan and then the green tire and wheel green interior so I'm gonna say this is probably attached to the front there I mean to the seats yeah you see the green plastic in there the muddy tires and then we have the white wheels with the little white ring around the edge and it does have the little M for matchbox here Willie's name more camouflage right there on the, on the hood. You see the little locks right there. The lights, the grill, all painted over in that nice tan color. We do have a little detail here for the hinge of the glass, but it doesn't really move. We do have a shovel. Then there's like a pickaxe or an axe down here. Looks more like an axe, but it's not painted in any different colors. Just the tan. We do have a, a handle right there. See the two green seats, a couple of gear shifters, and the big steering wheel. Jerry can in the back. All the lights are just painted over in the tan color. A nice tan Jeep. We do have the uh, windshield wipers molded on the glass there. That's pretty cool. Nice thick piece of glass. Nice and clear. You can see right through there. Really nice uh, version of the Willys Jeep. It looks very military with the with the tan and the camel colors. Another addition to the collection. And check this out. This one's called the Road Roller, number four of 100. And I don't think I have any of this in my collection. I'm not sure. I know I have some rollers, but I don't think I, I have this actual Matchbox roller. Let's see, what's the year on this one? Copyright 2021, all right, this is a new model then. Made in Thailand, 
R08, new model for the year 2022. Matchbox up here, road maintenance, and then Matchbox City Shield right there on the door. You see a couple of black handles. Number nine on the side there, big plastic roller. It does move. Big rugged tires with the Matchbox uh, raised letters right there. You can see that. Really cool raised letters. And we do have a little yellow ring on the on the wheel. Kind of like a mustard yellow for the actual vehicle. We have the caution uh, stripes and the caution word right there. Road maintenance. Nice lights up here. Really cool uh, tampon work on the side with a lot of little details. That looks really cool. I like the little stairs there, a little step or ladder to get up. Very cool. Let's, let's give him a little roll, see how he does. Wow, moves really nice. Big plastic wheel that actually works. Look at that. Not as fast as a uh, car, but uh, it moves. Yeah, the car goes, you can feel it, like the car will go much faster. Let's see. Yeah, it'll be faster than that. What do we call it again? The uh, Road Roller. All right, the Road Roller is pretty cool. I'm liking the Road Roller. Liking the Road Roller. And I also picked up the Matchbox Fire Dasher. This one comes from 2020 Mattel, so it's probably a new model last year. I know I have the red one, and this one's pretty cool in the two-tone. So I have the red one, which I think was the first one. And now it's recolored to the white, red, and then some gold details right in there and up on here. We do have a gold stripe on the side there with the red. That little trim on in gold looks pretty cool. And check out that yellow uh, light on top, yellow windshield with yellow windows on the side. Here are those gold details, plastic, red floor, uh, running boards, and then plastic details here on the side. This all feels like metal, cab. Part of the front end is all metal here on the sides and the front lights, this grill and the bumper plastic. Plastic on, all the red parts are plastic up here and here on the side. We do have the unit 12 fire department district uh, shield right there in a Red square with some gold trim around it and gold trim around that eagle. Very cool. We do have the hoses on the side. Looks like some fire extinguisher and axe. Unit 12. And unit 12 on this, one, this side, a ladder, more hoses. Really cool details. I'm loving it. Let's give him a slow spin so you can appreciate this matchbox how cool it looks. Really nice colors on this one. I think it looks really awesome. Top view. The base once again. There's a little elephant friend down here. And check it out. Looks pretty cool. I like the variation, pretty nice, pretty nice. So I didn't dig out my red one, but I do have the red one. So let's see, what have I collected this week for Matchbox? I got some really cool ones. So we got the Fire Dasher, Matchbox Fire Dasher, by the way. So it's like a Matchbox fantasy car, I guess you can say. The uh, Road Roller is also a fantasy car. It's marked Matchbox, no, no make on this one. It's just a fantasy by Matchbox, taking uh, ideas taken from the real life vehicles, probably. That's two pretty cool ones. We have the Coupe, 1936 Ford. We have the Ford Bronco. We have the Land Rover. We got a new Jeep, Willys Jeep, in the nice uh, tan color. Then over here we have the Hazmat Team, Matchbox Hazmat Team. This one is the Ford Police Interceptor with the new livery. 
and just add this one to the collection. And then we have this really nice uh, Opal, Opal uh, Cadet Coupe, also a new model for 2022, looking really awesome. I'm showing these for those of you who didn't see the, the ones I opened in the last couple of days. So I'm showing you all the ones I've been opening this week over the last few days. Got a bunch of new Matchbox added to collection. This is a Subaru Sandbar, if you don't know. Subaru Sandbar, made in Thailand, copyright 2018 on that one. And then we have the Fiat 500 in blue. It looks awesome. I have the red one. From last year, this is the new 2019 Fiat 500 Turbo for 2022. Very, very nice. And then we have the Jeep Renegade. Looking so cool in this nice uh, blue color. 2019 Jeep Renegade. Full of little garbage. Really nice uh, Jeep. Let me show you the front. There it is. Very, very nice. Awesome. I love it. And then we got this one. Can't remember the name of it, but it's marked under here. The Push and Puller. It's two front ends of a car. You can drive that way. You can drive that way. Which way you want to go? Left or right? <laughs> Either way, it'll go. Pretty funny the way they did the uh, tampon work. Friend or foe. I'm moving quick on these because I already made video for videos for them on the last couple days. Here's the uh, famous Matchbox Burger truck. Pretty cool. Grilled to perfection. 100% top quality meat. Home of the famous Bill's Bison Burger. Pretty cool. Put them right there. And then I picked up the paramedic. Really nice ambulance. The Peel Regional Services. And there's the base. It's the International Ambulance. Pretty nice. International Ambulance, pretty cool. Got the newest version of the self-driving bus. And I got another oldie. Check this out. Nice blue, look at the Chevy badge in front. Two door, look at that tall roof. 34 Chevy, Master Coupe. Very cool, plastic fenders, plastic lights, plastic uh, bumper in the front. The grill's painted on the die cast there or tampoed in. We do have the spare tire covered up in the back no mirrors on the side on this uh beautiful chevy master coupe a 34 chevy master coupe we usually see like the 34 ford which is very abundant in the hot wheels line and then we saw this one a little while ago this is another one that i opened up the bmw uh three series touring wagon and there's the license plate touring wagon on the plate and the matchbox name. Beautiful wagon, four doors, big sunroof on there on the top. Looks like a double sunroof. Little roof rack, blacked out wheels. Looks amazing. Really nice, really nice. And what else do we have? We have the Bronco. Okay, we showed all of them. Wow, we showed everything we've opened this week. All right, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed checking out the new Matchbox that I'm adding to the collection. Some really nice cars. Leave me a comment. Let me know which one you like the best. Let me know how your collecting is going. What's happening in your collecting world? What are you after? Hot Wheels, Matchbox, or any other brands? Let me know about it. It's awesome to read your comments, guys. Leave me a like on this video and... If you're new here, don't forget, hit that subscribe button. should be a subscribe button down there somewhere. I appreciate you guys supporting the channel. Thank you so much, guys, for all the new subs. I appreciate you guys. Welcome, new subscribers. It's nice to have you here. Thanks for being part of Marky's Toy World family. I'll see you guys in the next video.